Yellowstone star Kevin Costner offers praise to America Ferreira's Barbie monologue at the 2024 Golden Globes. Quote, it's an important message. This story comes to us from Spencer Bakuli over at Bounding Into Comics. In adding his voice to the chorus of those praising the climactic moment for how it purportedly brings awareness to the female experience, Yellowstone star Kevin Costner took a moment during an onstage appearance at the 2024 Golden Globe Awards to offer a personal tip of his hat to the important message of Barbie's climactic, Greta Gerwig-written, America Ferrera-delivered monologue. That's right. Costner gave his compliments to the live-action film's most discussed scene while appearing alongside Ferreira herself to present the event's award for Best, uh, Best Television Female Actor. After taking the stage together, Ferreira, op- Ferreira excuse me, opened a prepared remark skit by asserting to her co-host, Kevin, first, can I just say I'm such a fan of yours? Like, the bodyguard, when you say goodbye to Rachel and then she leaves and then she leaves... You run into each other and then chills. A real human being said this on television, nationally transmitted television. They actually said this. Amazing. Seemingly taken aback by her statement, it cannot be undersold whether through terrible direction or genuine discomfort between the two actors, just how awkward this moment feels. The Man of Steel actor replied in turn, well, you know, you have a scene that I really love. I think a lot of people really love that scene. And Ferreira asks, really, uh, which scene is that? Costner then affirmed, the Barbie movie. You know, the one where you talk about how it's literally impossible to be a woman. You know, you're so beautiful, you're so smart, and it kills me that you don't think you're good enough. That was pretty good. He added, and then he, his statements met with an exceptionally sparse amount of applause. Uh, applause the audience, seemingly unsure whether the two were being sincere or trying to pull off a joke. And see, that America Ferreira and Kevin Costner, you know, a real quick joke about how they're different, and that would have been enough. But trying to get them to compliment each other's filmography as a, uh, I don't know, a joke, isn't going to work. Uh, they, don't, they don't really have good chemistry. You can just tell that by looking at them, the two of them together. Uh, making a joke about how different their worlds are would have been better than trying to get them to, like, backhandedly compliment each other. I'm, I'm not sure what's happening here. Further blurring that line, Ferreira then playfully pressed, did you, Kevin Costner, memorize my monologue about womanhood from Barbie? To which Kevin Costner bluntly replies, no. Taking note of the apparent failure of their exchange to land with the audience, the actor then elaborated, but it's an important message, really. And it always serves to remind me what's possible in a film. It just reminds me that when we take our time when we manage to get it right, when a film is working at its very best, it can be about moments you never, ever forget. A look, a touch, a kiss, a speech. You had one of those moments. And then they go on to introduce the nominees for the the sketch here. So there you go. Um, Just because uh, a very bad, badly written skit and obviously badly executed skit went even worse... (laughs) Uh, Kevin Costner ended up complimenting the uh, incredibly politically charged speech that America Ferreira's character makes in the Barbie movie. Uh, I Again, like they just had to give him a line about like, hey, I come from the farm, I come from the city, we're so different, ha ha ha. Off to the nominees. This whole thing about making them compliment each other in a backhanded way somehow, it, it I absolutely didn't land. And chiefly because these are two people that don't really have a lot in common. You know, I'm pretty sure that like Robert Downey Jr., even though he won an award this year from this this uh, show, he had the ability, he could have come up there and read that and had a much better time with America Ferreira because, again, he has that sort of commonality with her. I'm not sure what it is, but he has that common energy with her. Kevin Costner, not so much. He has a more stoic energy than that playful, let's tell little jokes thing, you know, and that they really screwed this up. But again, here's more for Barbie, I guess. They got so nominated, they ended up with only one award, but at least Kevin Costner liked America Ferreira's speech, right? At least the Waterworld guy liked it. 